Violence against women, a phenomenon as old as human civilization. Evgenia Moraitaki, a Greek writer, spoke out uh, about women's abuse in a Greek literature association event. She stated, the problem of women being abused does not have color, continent, culture, and economic substance. It is, a, it is a plaque that expands rapidly in the entire planet. According to the Department of Justice, the statistics of women, uh, of women abuse say that 4 million women each year are being assaulted and beaten. Every 9 seconds in the, in the United States, a woman is being abused. Good morning. My name is Sophie Lukakis, and today I would like to tell you about the important issue of, being, of women's abuse and to convince you that there is a solution, uh, there are solutions to this problem, provide all of us to believe in a solution. A woman is considered to be abused when she sustains a continuous bodily and psychological uh, violence from a man that forces her to follow his wishes without being interested in her rights. Women's abuse falls into a common pattern, the so-called cycle of violence. The cycle of violence begins with abuse. Uh, abuse is a power play designed to show the victim who is the boss. Guilt follows. The guilt is over the possibility uh, to be cut and facing consequences. Next come rationalization and excuses. Uh, the, the, uh, the criminal may come with a string of excuses well, the string of excuses, or blame the victim for his own abusive behavior, anything to shift his responsibility from himself. The next step is the normal behavior. The abuser does everything in his power to take control over the victim again and make her feel that he has really changed. Fantasy and planning uh, begin. The abuser begins to fantasize, to fantasize about abusing his victim again and spending a lot of time thinking what she has done wrong, wrong and how he is going to make her pay. Then he makes a plan and put his plan in motion. The setup begins. The abuser put, put his uh, plan in motion and, uh, and um, take the victim and make her pay. The cycle of abuse begins once again. There are different types of women's abuse. This includes emotional, physical, sexual, and economic abuse. It's impossible to know with, uh, what's going on behind closed doors, but, uh, but there are some symptoms and signs which include depression, crying, low self-esteem, isolation from friends and family, <coughs> frequent injuries with the excuse of accidents. Now that we investigate the problem, we will now cover some potential solutions. The ideal solution to this problem would be to take uh, the victim away from the criminal. But uh, because this is something difficult and sometimes impractical, the only real solution can come from the victim herself. The victim must realize that she must uh, ask for help and find an end to the threats. She should therefore think what she really wants, love and care or beating and ill treatment. She needs to accept and love herself, to, lo to respect herself in order for others to respect her too. Without question, the real, uh, the real solution to this problem uh, can come from the victim herself. A Greek website called Women Only, in the article there is a solution writes that one month ago, the, pu the public was upset by the picture of pop singer Rihanna after the beating she experienced from her boyfriend, rapper Chris Brown. To everyone's surprise, the TV reported that the pair is once again together, after so many arguments. Meanwhile, another famous woman, the model and ex Mrs. Great Britannia, Danielle Lloyd, publicly spoke out about uh, the violence that existed between her and her former lover. In contrast to Rihanna, 
However, the 25 years old uh, Lloyd has never come together with her former abuser. That's, um, the photographs that she released to the public are enough for anyone to observe the results and, real and realize the dangerous effects of abuse. We have previously referred on two examples of how to face the problem of abuse, one positive and one negative. We should take example of Danielle Lloyd's decision, a decision that every assaulted woman should follow. We have seen the problem, we have been given a solution, and we have been able to visualize what happens when the solution is implemented. What can each of us do in order to help a someone which is in an abusive situation? In conclusion, I encourage you all to report suspected women's abuse. If you are afraid of getting involved, remember that your report is private and everything possible will be done to protect your privacy. You don't have to give your name and your suspicions will be investigated before anyone is taken into custody. Most important, you can protect the victim from further harm by calling for help. Call 911 and for call National Domestic Violence Hotline for advice and support. 1-800-799-7233. Do you have any questions? There are a lot of uh, abuse over in Greece. Yeah. That one as well. It's everywhere. I think it's, it's everywhere. everywhere yeah.